Hello there and welcome to the next episode of Like That Try This. In today's episode we're going to be looking at the Society's Red Burgundy. Let's pour it out and have a look. As you'd expect from Pinot Noir, it has a fantastic bright red currant character in the glass. Really nice and pale, just as you would expect. On the nose, there's plenty of cherry kernel and red currant and a little bit of strawberry as well. It's really fresh and inviting. The palate is medium bodied with plenty of bright, fresh acidity and a little bit of grip coming from the red burgundy here. But again, the flavour is very similar to the nose. It's quite perfumed, there's plenty of cherry and red currant, uh, and it's just a really lovely, inviting, relatively ripe vintage for the Society's red burgundy, so it's absolutely delicious. So we're going to be looking for a red wine which is medium bodied, but with that fantastic acidity and red currant cherry crunch flavour. And we're going to be going from Burgundy to Spain. We're going to be trying out the Menthea grape variety, which is very, very popular in the area of Galicia, more specifically Ribera Sacra. So as you can see in the glass, very similar colour profile, possibly slightly deeper, slightly darker, but it's kind of a, a, a light plum red cherry colour. On the nose, very similar, so you've got that cherry, you've got the cherry kernel, and it's almost a, a sappy, almost between a Pinot Noir and a Beaujolais in style. It smells fantastic, again, really inviting, you just want to, just want to dive in. Slightly fully, but fuller bodied than the Society's Red Burgundy. A little bit more weight and possibly a touch more tannin as well, but most importantly, the tannin is super ripe. The Galicia is a quite cool, wet area thanks to the Atlantic just over the way. And so there's fantastic freshness in this wine. It'll be fantastic with food, any sort of red game meat, or alternatively, if you were looking for a red wine with fish, this would be absolutely perfect and it's a really nice alternative for those wanting to step outside of the box from Red Burgundy and explore something a little bit different. The next wine I've chosen, we are going to Austria, uh, to Burgenland, and the grape variety I've chosen is one called Blaufrankisch. This is the Hitti Pitnauer from 2016. Again, in the glass, just what we saw from the Menthia and the Society's Red Burgundy, so it's a lovely light red currant colour. And this is fantastic because the Society's Red Burgundy does just have a, a touch of spiciness to it, almost a little kind of green stalkiness as well. And this wine for me has that in spades. There's loads of spicy bramble fruit whilst maintaining that lovely red fruit character. And that carries on to the palate as well. Those tannins are so delicious. They really kind of a little fuzzy note on the bottom of your mouth. But the, the um, fruit is so delicious and ripe, as well as that fantastic spiciness you get from the Blau Frankish grape. It's probably a little bit more savoury than the red burgundy as well. And again, this could probably kind of match along slightly richer meats, maybe some red meats as well. But again, it's a really lovely alternative to the Society's Red Burgundy, and I really encourage you to, to give it a whirl in our current Like That Try This offer. Cheers. Thank you.